everybody today is Tuesday and we are back in school um, if you guys don't know I homeschool Zion so this is our third year doing homeschool he's in first grade and uh, right now I am going to prep our lunch for today so today I'm gonna to be making like a refried bean homemade uh, tortillas so I'm gonna do that and I already have my beans that I have uh, heated through and I heated up soaked overnight and um, strained them washed them again and then uh, boiled them again so they're ready and I just rolled out this right here um, it's the masa so I have a little bit of masa there I normally buy my corn tortillas at the store, but I didn't have any on hand, so I did have masa. So I'm just making my own. So it's just I'm just going to roll this out. So we're going to have it with some refried beans. Um, I'm going to chop up some lettuce and. I'm just gonna have that with some vegan cheese, some avocado on top, some tomatoes, fresh diced tomato, and that's it. Probably do a little salsa on top, but that's gonna be our lunch. And these are not perfectly round whatsoever. So don't judge me on that because I am not trying to be like super perfect. I just wanted the base to be a corn tortilla, so that's practically what I'm doing. So just rolling it out as thin as possible. are dangerous. Let's clean up. Pick up the crayons. Can you help mommy clean up? Clean up, clean up. Go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Mira, mira que pasó. Look what you did. It's 
¿Se rompió una serra? So done. Look what you did. You broke one of brother's crayons. He's like, I'm not even bothered. What are you talking about? I'm not even bothered by that. These are brothers. One year old and a first grader at home, so. Oh goodness. Water spilled on the floor and just stuff everywhere. Well anyway, I'm gonna continue um, making lunch and show you guys the um the whole thing after it's all done all right so my corn tortillas have been cooked i put my last one on the skillet and i'm going to show you guys a trick when you don't have like a tortilla press to make perfectly round circle tortillas i just grabbed a, a bowl one of my cereal bowls and i'm just gonna put it on top of the tortilla and cut around the perimeter of the bowl to make it into a circle and so that is a way to have symmetrical um, tortillas and don't throw these little pieces away you can use these for like tortilla chips um, all kinds of things so hold on to those little pieces so as you can see it makes a perfectly round circle corn tortilla and they're all the same so then you won't have ugly looking tortillas they look like this so homemade tortillas here okay remember how i told you guys that to save the scraps that um from the tortillas that um what i did with them was i just seasoned them with a little bit of cajun seasoning some onion powder uh chipotle powder some chili powder and garlic powder and i baked them in the oven and they're so good as a little snack it's literally a homemade tortilla chip it's really good zion and zidane are eating their snack what's up zion has some in a plate and um we're just taking a break right now and the baby is making a mess. He has some yogurt. What you doing? You making a mess? He's eating his breakfast from this morning. He had a little bit of the tortilla that we made, but he woke up kind of late, so. But these are so good. They're like super seasoned. Mmm. So good. You can buy these at the store, like kind of similar, similar flavored, but there's nothing like making your own and knowing what's all in there. All the ingredients and whatnot that you're putting in there. So, yeah. It's really easy. But it's really good. But we're about to get back to work. Our break will be over soon, so we're going to finish up our paperwork and stuff like that that we have to do. And then we'll be having lunch later on, around like 12 20 so yeah that's pretty much what we do for our day um it's pretty much the same every day but um we enjoy it zion enjoys it he enjoys being homeschooled you like homeschool yeah they're yeah, they spicy too they're a little spicy <laughs> yeah all right guys see you later
guys so I'm back at home from the gym and now I'm just going to make some muesli which is like some oatmeal with different types of nuts and dry fruit and I'm just heating that up over the stove and I'm going to have that with like some almond butter, bananas, that's it. I'm just going to flavor it with a little bit more brown sugar and start the rest of my day. So it is 6.07 a.m. so I get um, ready at the gym like after I work out I just go ahead and take a shower there do everything I need to do and then I come back home to um, eat breakfast so the kids are still asleep um, Zach is up normally around this time and about to let the dogs out and let them go potty in on that jazz but that's normally my typical workout day um, early in the morning starting at 3 a.m and get to the gym at least by four o'clock so then I can have at least an hour workout. But um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Make sure to like this video, share this video. If you have any comments, make sure to comment down in the comment box and we'll see you guys in the next vlog, bye.